There we go. <laughs> I have my Steam overlay up if I can't get this down. Uh, this is day eight. We still don't have online servers. One of these days, I will. Uh, we'll get servers. So to recap what we left off last time, um, I did. Uh, actually, let me type this in real quick. I really do want kind of want to go over some of the bosses that we went through, so I can actually remember a couple. <laughs> this is kind of more for a personal reason, but if you actually do want to get an idea, um, okay, that's right. So we did fight two bosses last stream. Uh, we fought Chaos, which what I don't know how to say her last name. It's a Quilag. I'd say it's like Quilag, but we fought her, lost. No, actually, no. We beat that in first try. I actually somehow beat that first try. I was very proud of myself. Gasp indeed. Um, <laughs> that was good timing. Uh, and then we fought Iron Golem, which we only did one attempt, but we got absolutely destroyed. But we've been trying to go through uh, Sin's Fortress. I did decide to briefly look up a walkthrough to get an idea what the fortress was like. <laughs> And see if there is anything else I'm missing. I do realize I am actually at the very end of the fortress. Um, but my thought was just trying to figure out if there was a bonfire anywhere nearby. I did discover that there is. I am going to grab it. Because <laughs> I need to save myself some time. Uh, also, I did kind of update the overlay a little bit. Because I felt like I was blocking the boss health meter and stuff before. So I decided to move that around. Other than that, that's really all I got. I don't know how we're gonna do. I do know that I wanna grab that bonfire. I'm gonna try to be Iron Golem tonight. That's my goal. I feel like it's gonna take all stream. <laughs> that's how it feels. But, I think the only thing I don't really know is how much damage Iron Golem takes when you do attack it. So I never got a hit in. If I can get an idea of how much damage it takes, once if I can get like a hit. Ow. I don't know. I'm already off to a bad start. <laughs> you know what? Maybe I should already restart. <laughs> it's not worth it. <laughs> it's not worth it. <laughs> Uh, you know what? Alright, we'll fight this one at least out here. We'll go back and heal off, but damn. That was... Not a good start. We're just warming up, you know? No big deal. <laughs> Okay, let's go down here. Also, everyone that was just joining in, and that's probably heard me talk before, or has seen my mic before. Uh, that may be lurking or whichever. Uh, this is still the same microphone that I've had. I decided to get a windscreen. I finally took some time to look back and hear back on some videos I've been uh, talking through lately. And I didn't realize I was very poppy with some of the my uh, words that I've been saying. Like, it made the sent the microphone sound very, very bad. <laughs> and all the breathing and the popping and all that jazz. So I got a windscreen. I got, came in this morning. It is actually quite, it's kind of bulky, but it does its job, I suppose. But hopefully the audio sounds a little bit better. I do apologize <laughs> if there has been a lot of like popping, because I know like when I left like that just now, um, it felt very airy. I suppose like it, I can hear the air. So it wasn't good. So I wanted to fix that. And hopefully this does, you know, fix it. Well, overall, I do apologize about that. But going forward, it should be fine. If there are still issues, I'll, you know, look into it later.
But thank you. That's all I have. That's, that's all I got. <laughs> The goal is just to get through here quickly. They don't have as much to do here. As I originally thought. I don't know if we can actually walk through here quickly, but we'll try. <laughs> ah, crap. There we go. Oh my god, I need to get a swing. <laughs> gonna die there <laughs> or at least get badly damaged I was gonna be hurt very badly hey if you didn't know like this microphone um, for those that don't know anything about microphones uh, this the one I have is called the Rode pod mic and it is an XLR microphone which means it doesn't use like USB it's just into into like an audio interface uh, the microphone itself has a built-in windscreen, but I kind of felt like, I guess maybe it wore off or maybe something got messed with a little bit that resulted in kind of stuff that has been happening. I know I kind of already just explained it, but I just want to explain it again. <laughs> but that's, that's, that's pretty much the reason why I didn't have one originally. I want to mess around with it a little bit. I felt like overall it's it should be good now. Going forward. Actually not doing too bad. No, not on wood. For example. You usually get those three hits on. <laughs> We're actually not doing bad at all. But yeah, since we last played, I haven't touched anything. I did. I was debating if I wanted to grind, just because how badly <laughs> that encounter with uh, the Iron Golem went. I decided not to, so I was afraid I might either over level or I might get into situations where I don't even need to, like, I might not even need to grind. Like, I don't know how the situation's gonna go. Like, we only did one fight against it. So I might do really good. <laughs> I might do really bad. Alright, I know you're there. There we go. Come on. Okay. Oh crap. <laughs> I almost messed that up. Oh man. Okay. Oh no. Oh well. Did you die? Yep. <laughs> I bring it on and just hops off the cliff. Alright. It's one way to uh avoid a terrible encounter. Okay. So, you want to see something funny? Might be surprised. I think it's here. Yeah, right here. Look what's here. <laughs> There's a bonfire. And yes, I'm going to rest out. I didn't know it was here. I think if you play online, it's a lot easier to tell. Because people can just leave no notes and stuff for you. 
Wait, no, no online server? I can't really tell. So yeah, I guess it's on your room. That's the only thing I really looked up. <laughs> Otherwise, I, I actually have no idea what's in here. I don't know if this leads back up or not. I just wanted to grab that. Where are we? I just hope this quickly leads back up. <laughs> oh, we're right there. Damn. That should not bad at all. All right, actually real quick. Stand by. My lips appear shinier because they are. <laughs> I was kind of talking, my lips kind of felt very chappy, chapped, just chapped up. I need a chapstick, battling. That's all it is. We're chapped up. All right, cool. I'm actually very, very happy about this now. I think it's gonna save a lot of time. I, I guess I could potentially, I need to kill you. I think that's what I need to do is take you out. There are those soldiers down there. So let's kick them out. There's two of them down here. Like, I know they're not that tough. Like, two hits, move on. <laughs> I love big swords too much. <laughs> I was watching other play styles. <laughs> The other day, I kind of have curiosity. I'm like, I really want to know how the game plays. Magic looks really cool. I feel like if I play Dark Souls 2 or 3 at some point someday, I kind of want to try out other classes or just other play styles and see if I actually like them. I do feel like in this game in particular, I've really come to enjoy just using a big sword like this. I haven't found a better weapon other than this. I feel like it's gotten the perfect weight, perfect attack style. For what's suited for my play style and I don't want to change anything I'm afraid to get hit here I just want to keep running all right let's take you out there we go I do know there's an archer I don't know where I might have ran right by it is above me. Yeah, I think it's right over here. Yeah, it's up there. Now I don't remember. All right, let me in, let me in, let me in. All right, the boss is there. I could actually get my flask, uh, not my flask, my uh, souls back. I wanted to give it a try. Do we go over here? So there's only like, yeah, there's only like a chair. Something else in here, right? Right? I feel like there's something here. <laughs> like there's gotta be something. Like anything? Hello? All right. Maybe not. Maybe I'm missing something. I don't know. All right, I need to take the big guy out, like above me. If I lose my souls, it's fine. At least I can get these souls back. I highly doubt I'm getting those souls back, but I need to take this guy out. At least, Die trying. I 
actually kind of sounds like you know, they get twisted. Oh no. That's not good. Where am I? Uh, where did I fall? Okay, run. <laughs> I don't know where I fell. Right, we're falling, we're falling, we're falling, we're falling, we're moving. Oh, he can definitely kill me from here. All right, I know where I am. I was trying to figure out a way to maybe like twist my body around. Possibly uh, hear those lovely sounds, but. Maybe get twisted around so it doesn't attack me. It sounds like when I was going up, I was turning. If I can get it to turn. Or at least maybe I might just have to run up there and fight it. I don't give it an opportunity to do anything. But my fear is how tough it's going to be. Like, I hope it's just really big with low HP. Like, it can just take me out in like two hits. I'd be okay with that. <laughs> Alright, let's give this a try. Hello. Oh, Jesus. Heal up. Can I get a this roll? Back, maybe? Nope. Oh, boy. Yep. I'm in trouble. I need to get tired again. Actually, not that bad. I was trying to see if I could, like, this, like, <laughs> you know, but just butt. <laughs> I think it's dead, though. All right, here's my goal. I'm going to die, probably, but if I can get behind that iron golem and grab my uh, souls that I've lost in the past, I'll consider that a, uh, I'll consider it a win. Might be in a lot better position than I thought I was going to be. A uh, big guy. <laughs> okay. Alright, I need to get by. Actually, can this thing fall off the map? Dark Soul enemies are known to fall off the maps. So I'm kind of curious. Actually, if I'm close to it, it's not bad. Jeez. <laughs> but if I'm not close to it, <laughs> that happens. I'm kind of curious if we can stay by the ledge here. I can just fight here. That's kind of tough. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, well. We can win this. It's going to take a couple tries. Can you just stay by its legs? Get this thing to tilt over? Yeah! Oh. 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 Um. Whoa, what is it? Okay, um, wow. I was not expecting that. All right. I don't know if any mods are there. If you're able to edit the boss's command, I appreciate it. If not, I'll edit it in a minute. But, um, I'm out of that. I think I'm going to, I'm going to get to the bonfire. I'm going to come back for that. Oh, okay. I'll run back up. I don't know what, where, where that's going to lead me. I am going to play it safe. I'm going to save.
Did that come back to life? Did they all come back to life? No. Alright, just the one. Or at least just the one I think that's alive. <laughs> I'm kind of curious if we can get to that one and take it out. I have to do like a running jump over there. I just need to go save. That's all I want to do. It's gonna hurt. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> My worst case, I die right there. <laughs> Alright, we can level up a bit. Uh, you know what we're gonna do? Let's do... Get like a bunch of strength. I want to get some endurance, but I also want some strength. I'm okay with that. How many swings can I do? Okay. One, two. <laughs> Something like three, but. Do I have any soul? Did I have any souls? Did I actually just get souls? I mean, I got those. I do have these. <laughs> you know, let's use them. Kind of curious what the large soul's gonna get me. That's a lot. I may wait. I need how many now? 17,000? Yeah, there's no way I have that many. I have souls, but not that many. Because I know I have like the small ones. These are like, probably like a thousand. That's probably like 400 ish. I think it's like 40. That's probably 1200. There may be a thousand. I might be a little over that. Yeah, I don't have enough. We'll save them for other occasions. <laughs> if I get a lot over time. But I'm happy. We'll see how much. Uh See how much, how well we do. I want to get those souls like into weapons. I want, I want to figure out how to do that if I can. I figured it'd be like the blacksmith, but maybe it's like a, you know, like a specific thing for the blacksmith. Alright, well, we'll climb back up, we'll get to that thing, and then we'll go from there. I want to see how well, actually, I do with you. That's more damage. Let's see, one, two. That was a good way to judge. That was still hollow. One AKO. Anything over here now? <laughs> Have curiosity. No? Alright, well. Had to check. Uh, so did that. Yeah, let me actually. I'm gonna update this real quick. If I can remember how to, <laughs> I can. How's our weekends or <laughs> how's our weekends going? How are we all doing today? What are we up to?
Okay. That's better. Thank you for dealing with that. Mm, I may have messed up my Steam overlay. I can't get it to close. <laughs> this is the issues I was having last time uh, with the game. Rule of thumb. So I'll start alt tabbing before you do anything else going forward. There we go. Could not get it out of that screen. You don't see it. I see it. Okay, let's see what this is. Salmon Ring of Light. Little red fruit. Thank you for the follow. How you doing? They're just dropping it somewhere. <laughs> this actually looks beautiful. Oh, they spoke of this. It was this Anor Londo. Hi. Oh, does this just bring me back? Alright, well, good to know. Yeah, for, so for those who are just joining them, <laughs> I uh, ended up getting to Sin's Fortress. Um, Sen's. I always say Sin. Sen's Fortress. We beat the Iron Golem. I didn't realize there was a strategy behind it. I kind of saw this and I was like, you know what? This is actually really thin. What if I just follow him here? I can kind of like... Get under his legs, roll under him, attack him. It ends up he can just fall off. <laughs> so it fell. Uh, it died. Victory. Yay. That's really it. I still want to go back to the other old areas. Because <laughs> so, there's still a lie, so I want to go back and explore. I'll stick with, we'll stick with this for now. Can I skip this? I can. Cool. This area is gorgeous. Just like the lighting with everything. I don't even feel like I'm playing the same game anymore. It's so different. That feels familiar though. Kinda. You're big. What are you doing? Gonna go. Kind of waiting for him to all just jump me. So why do they drag me here? Why are they kind of just standing still? Oh, okay. I was kind of wondering if that was an elevator. <laughs> I 
can't even go back up. Unless it goes back down. Oh yeah, it does. Cool. <laughs> I was wondering if I did. Will you go down? I think I'm just a little worried about the enemies of my I don't want to start anything. If it's going to get too overly complicated. You look like something I'm going to have to fight, though. Because you're charging at you. Are you like the bell, bell gargoyle? You're like a regular enemy? Actually, you didn't do that much damage. That wasn't bad. Is this what I think it is? Ace. It might be. I don't know. Also, hello. What do you think this is? Because... Actually, no, I'll just tell you. <laughs> uh, this place is called Norlando, if I got that right. We beat the boss just now. Yay, me. <laughs> I was honestly thinking it was going to take all stream. <laughs> it took 15 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and there's nothing at the edge here. I, I guess. I don't know if you want to list the bosses I fought, fought fight words. Um, we do have it to command exclamation mark bosses. Give you an idea of how, who have I fought. If you want an idea. But yeah, we be a boss. I um, used, I guess, a trick to beat it. There was like a little method you can make it a lot, a lot easier. It worked out. Very happy about it. You don't know if I'm right? Okay. I was kind of presuming this might be something from like Dark Souls 3 or something like that. This area is gorgeous though. We just got here. We haven't even been here maybe like five minutes. <laughs> but we walked in, there's kind of a bunch of statues kind of just standing around not really doing much of anything. And that gargoyle looking enemy was the first thing that actually attacked us when we were down here. <laughs> proud of you. Thank you. <laughs> I'm proud of me too. Also, uh, if you're kind of curious, for those who are just coming in too, I'm going to kind of say this on and off during the stream. Um, if you're kind of noticing my mic looks a little different today, I bought a windscreen for my mic. Uh, I was listening back in on previous streams. And it kind of sounded like I was making a lot of popping sounds. I didn't realize that. Like, breathing into the mic, poppy, like, I, I didn't like it. And the microphone's supposed to have, like, a built-in one. And I felt like when I first got it, I didn't really experience it that much. But maybe it was a lot worse than I thought it was. <laughs> it bothered me. That's all I gotta say. So I decided to buy this. It kind of just goes over the microphone. Um, if I sound any different... Or if it sounds bad or anything in that regard, feel free to let me know. Especially if it's like poppy, popping, bubbly. <laughs> Any breathing sound that sound really bad, uh, please let me know. But if it sounds good, then it sounds good. Probably will. That's that's all I really got. A microphone in your mic? Exactly. No. Um, I'm not sure if I said that. If I did, I'm sorry. But no, so one of these things, like this, like this is, not sure how to talk without actually grabbing it, but this is like a, uh, it's like a filter. I guess it's the best way I can actually it. It's just a big foam that goes over our microphone. And that's what this is. And it's, it's supposed to stop the pops <laughs> if it gets too poppy. I had it in my previous microphone. Um, I kind of had like a big round looking thing. This one just goes right over the microphone. 
which I think is a lot nicer. It is big, but I feel like it does its job. Elden Ring. Giddy, giddy, giddy. Here's a oh fire, 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 fire. Just <laughs> gonna start screaming fire. The hell are you? I'm gonna rest and then I'm gonna talk to you. Um, I do plan on getting it. I am going to get it. I'm waiting for a sale. <laughs> I feel like a sale will come fast. <laughs> also, I heard there was like an update that came out that messed with something. Maybe nerfed one of the bosses. So I'm kind of curious if they'll fix that. But I, I want to get it within like the next month or three. <laughs> I want to get it by July. Now I know for sure I want it by July. Which July is a lot closer than you think. <laughs> um, I'm going to get it on my Xbox. Because I ended up getting gift cards for it. And my PC can't really handle that kind of gaming right now. <laughs> so I want to get it on console. And my brother wants to play it too. And we share games. So I was going to get it on there. Um, but I have gift cards. I can get it now. But I'm going to hold off until... Because I got like $15 promotional credit. And it doesn't expire until July. So I'm kind of curious if there's a sale prior to that. And if there is, then I'll nab it. Even if it's only $10 off. <laughs> Uh, I have a screen one on my mic. As long as it's in front of the mic, it works well. Yes. I'll say that again. Did I speak too fast? I Question. Honest question. <laughs> Did I speak too fast or was my, uh, my words not going through? If you don't mind me asking. But... Um... I'm going to get it on my Xbox instead of Steam. Maybe sometime down the road I'll get it on Steam. But I want to get it on my console because my brother wants to play it too. And we share games digitally <laughs> through our console. So I'm going to get it on console. And I have a gift card that I'm waiting to use it on. So also very delayed. Okay. <laughs> no, you're good. Um, but no, I want to get it by July. That's my goal. Because I have promotional credit and then gift cards I got them from like Christmas that I've never used. So, and, and my birthday. So I want to use those, I want to use those gift cards and the credit that I got toward Elden Ring. And I have enough to get it now, but I'm just waiting to see if there's like a sale. Console. <laughs> I know. Trust me, I want I want to get it on Steam. Or at least PC. Uh, I don't think my graphics card is going to handle it very well. <laughs> Not even the right console. Listen, I know. I disappoint a lot of people. I mean, I'm not against rebuying it sometime down the road and replaying it on PC. Because, I mean, let's be real, I probably will. But I think for now, I want to get it on... It, for family reasons. <laughs> I want to get it on console. But I'll definitely rebuy it probably at some point. But that's where my head's at. <laughs> I will get Elden Ring. It will be someday. I know. There's probably millions of people who are just like, why? If it wasn't, you can blame my brother. Just blame my brother. Uh, he's the only reason. <laughs> if it wasn't for him. My oldest brother wasn't for my oldest brother <laughs> i'd probably wait and get it on pc i probably would never have an xbox but he doesn't play con uh anything but his xbox and his switch which honestly respect <laughs> for the limited stuff that he has <laughs> blame big bread brother i <laughs> love lola <laughs> love his life She's been very sleepy today. I got home, she was just sleeping. Up until I had dinner. Then she went back to sleep. But yeah, she, uh, World of the Game, Elden Ring wise. I want it. I'm gonna get it. I'm just waiting. Also, I'm still playing the first Dark Souls. So I figured maybe once I finish this, well, once I finish this, I wanna play Near Replicant. And then after Near Replicant, I don't know where I'll be at mind mindset wise. But I want to play Near Replicant next. 
And then after that, I don't know where I'll be. So I think I want to take like a small break from Souls and then jump into another Souls. But Elden Ring would be a good one to jump into. And then I could always do Dark Souls like 2 and 3 or something like that sometime down the road. <laughs> I still haven't started Dark Souls 1. That's totally fun. I feel like you've seen a good chunk of Dark Souls 1 already. <laughs> You may definitely need a break from Souls. Because that's how I felt. I think the only game I played recently consecutively was Metroid. Because I ended up doing all the portable like 2D Metroids consecutively. Non-stop. And then I eventually played Dread last year. I think that burns me out. That was like an experience where I was like, you know what? I enjoyed the games. They were great. I never want to do that again. Because <laughs> I felt like I think I would have enjoyed them a lot more if I played them out. Like, sparingly. But I played them in chronological order instead. Still like them. But I don't think I want to do that again. <laughs> like, I don't want to do, like, Dark Souls 1, 2, 3. Like, back to back to back. I think breaks are good. I almost burned out after Dark Souls 3. Which is hilarious in the context of Souls. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, let me ask you, how many hours are you currently into Elden Ring? Also, let me go talk to this guy as we wait. Well, you are a rare visitor. Let me talk to this woman, I'm going to apologize. City of Anor London, chosen undead. If you seek Lord Gwyn's old keep, exit here and head straight yonder. If you are the chosen one, a revelation shall visit you. What follows thereafter depends upon you. Reinforce Estes Flask? Use Fire Keeper Soul to reinforce. What's that do? Wait, I have a couple of these. I'm going to hold off on using another one. <laughs> Fill with Estes on Bonfire kills HP. Does it heal me more? So I have like one, one or two more of those. I have a couple of these. One more. Boost power of, oh. All right, I'm gonna hold off because I don't know if it's gonna, I don't know if I'm spending. I will use reverse hollowing. I have, I now have skin. Um, smooth skin. Maybe it's Maybelline, but I don't know if I'm wasting them all and it's like plus one and then I don't get it back. I'm gonna wait. <laughs> Only 30 hours, less than half the time it took me to be Dark Souls 3. And it still feels like I'm in the beginning of Elden Ring. Jesus. That's the other thing. I did hear Elden Ring's very long, which terrifies me to stream because I feel like that's the only thing I would be streaming for a couple months, like at least two or three months. It would just be Elden Ring. It'd be the summer of Elden Ring. Which, I guess in some ways, that actually doesn't sound that bad. But I guess in the context of I like my backlog to get uh, moved quickly, it terrifies me. The map alone is wild. <laughs> would you say it's breathtaking? <laughs> oh, jeez. What are y'all doing? Like, can I get by? I would like to, to go to that. Is that like a cathedral? Uh, or Lord Gwyn's Keep, maybe? I need to look more into the lore. <laughs> I know Orlando. I don't think there's any other way I can go. I watch a couple friends play, and I don't even know where they are more than half the time. Well, I know we were watching... Well, I'll say in the context of this... Which is why I really like about Dark Souls. Um, I was watching, we were watching uh, uh, Saraha yesterday when she was playing Dark Souls. I feel like I'm definitely ahead of her, but she was exploring so many more different areas I have never explored yet. <laughs> and I was just looking at them like, I never even thought about doing that. There's a part at the very beginning where you can go down like a little walk path I've never explored down there. <laughs> I'm like, I didn't even know I could do that. <laughs> but I was just amazed. 
And she's, I think she's still early into the game. I just never went there, which that, that just blows my mind being like, oh, there's a lot that I missed. And then you can just take on different enemies or foes and go to different areas like whenever you want. I love that. Because everyone has different experiences. They're like, oh, I went there like way later in the game. Or, oh, I went there in the very beginning. <laughs> but, I don't know. That's, that's all I really got. That's the fun part of Dark Souls I found. I watch Let's Plays on YouTube after I explore an area and guarantee there's at least one to two things I miss. It's just wild just looking back at me like, wow, I did not go there. <laughs> I should have thought of that. And then actually seeing different weapons and like one-handed styles and shields and magic. Like I've been doing two-handed weapon. I've come to the conclusion I love my two-handed weapon. But overall, like I, like I tried using dexterity. It wasn't doing well for me. Getting strength up. Which I'm also learning, I want more endurance than vitality. I think I might be good for the moment. Never touching my vitality for the rest of the game. <laughs> I'm only focusing on like endurance for a while. Endurance and strength. With a little bit of dexterity. Like I feel like those are the three stats I want to focus on. And nothing else. I feel like I got my vitality up enough to a point where I feel like I can live. And then if I can just focus on my endurance and just get my defense up along with my stamina and then some of my strength you can see my stats yeah so for me personally this is how i've been liking it right now or what i'm slowly realizing um, i never touched intelligence faith or attunement i did learn those are more for like magic based stuff i started like, like what did we start with i think like 15 dexterity or something like that my strength was very low and now I have more strength and dexterity. <laughs> and then my vitality and my endurance, I was keeping leveled for a bit. But I got to a point where I felt like I prefer more endurance over strength. Or endurance over vitality. And plus endurance levels up defense. And it also helps with my equipment load, so I can even carry more weapons. Endurance is very, very important. Like, more important than vitality, I feel like. And then mixing dexterity up with, I think like you mentioned, I think our first stream you mentioned this. But like dexterity being important for our equipping weapons. And then strength is being to the point of having like damage. And then endurance mixing with that with stamina. That's where I'm like, I need to find like a middle ground. I feel like I'm finally getting to that middle ground. Looks sort of like my mid to late Dark Souls 3 points. I don't even know if I'm mid to late in this game. <laughs> I feel like we're getting far in the game. Like a good bit through. Also, I think I need to fight this guy. A little terrified. Like he's very friendly. Okay. He ain't friendly. You know what? All right, got problems. You're not that bad. It's like three hits. Oh yeah, you're not strong at all. Cool. How many soul? Alright, we're killing them. <laughs> Alright, I need to lure both y'all out. We have a bonfire behind us. We're taking advantage of this. And I have some souls in my pocket. So. I need some souls. Nice. It's very nice. Alright. Get you out a little bit more. Alright, here we go. Good enough. That's not good enough. There we go. Because it gives me 1500. Which I look at that, I'm like, that's ridiculous. Alright, come at me, bro. I think I kind of want to get. I want to get my endurance up more. I want to get to the point where I can swing this weapon four times. Like, that's a goal of mine. Ah, crap. <laughs> oh, no. 
Yo, yo, yo. That's a lot of health. <laughs> that was a bad roll. Oh, well, he hopped. Or it hopped. I can't not get a hit in. Get up, get up, get up. Now I'm just starting to think I got lucky on those first two. Or this one's just like invincible. <laughs> it's very possible. There we go. Perfect. All right, let me go back to that bonfire. <laughs> I mean, there's a couple more over there. I could take those two out real quick. There's actually three. No, there's three. My bad. So here's my strat. Um, I want to use the souls that I have acquired. Because I've had these for a while. I've been trying to wait for a perfect opportunity. I think I need 17. Also, I didn't realize I was 5,000. Yeah. So I just want to get one more level, and I'll be happy. Just happily move on. Perfect. Okay. Endurance. I literally want nothing but endurance. I'll get my defenses up. Get more stamina. How many swings? One, two, three. I can get four swings in. FMF full bar. I can get four swings in. One, two. Yeah. So as long as my bar is full, I can get four full swings. That's awesome. I ignore you guys now. Let's see, maybe I can get him knocked off the bridge. <laughs> That'd be nice. I just appreciate how much, how many souls they give you. They give you so many. <laughs> this would be a very, very quick way to level up if I really needed to. What is that? I've never seen a yellow door. I've seen white. I've never seen yellow. Examine brilliant light. Sealed by the great Lord's power. Can't go this way. <laughs> hey, let me in. <laughs> okay, so I guess I just can't go this way right now. Maybe I have to go back to previous areas. Only thing I can think of. Can't go here. Or if there's something I missed. Maybe there's another path I can take. You know what this actually kind of reminds me of? <laughs> Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> it's the weirdest comparison I just had. But <laughs> If you played Kingdom Hearts, you'll know what I mean, but... I gotta get Kingdom Kingdom Hearts vibes here. <laughs> Just like a little bit. <laughs> First thing you look at Dark Souls, what do you think of? <laughs> Definitely Mickey Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I can't go down that way. Why should we? No.
It's a no. Um, that led to nowhere. I have to be the chosen one, which I'm not apparently, so I can't go further. I guess I'll heal real quick while I'm up here. All right, I think I am gonna use the flask thing again. I think I don't. If you require rest, now is the time. That is, after all, what the bonfire is for. I think it just makes it stronger. I don't want to know who these people are. The other thing. I think it just makes it stronger. I don't think it's gonna weaken it. Or like lose it. I think it's like permanent. That's what I'm hoping for at least. Hello, hello. Bidet, good seeing you. Hello, bidet. Yeah, I don't think I can really go any further. So I went down that elevator. Can't go across. There's no like bridge or anything. Can't check check out that light. I want to go there. So I can't go there. I guess I just have to go back. I mean, there's still plenty of things I can check out. Back this way. I can still check out the catacombs. I can check out the the ruin. Like anything with the ghosts, I could check out. Pretty much the two. It's just those two. <laughs> There's a couple places I could check out. This just feels like end game. <laughs> or like getting to end game or something like that. That's what it feels like. I'm always checking back and be like, is there anyone in here? All right. So, you know, maybe things change. Kill a boss. Okay, I forgot about you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's one of those things I actually expected it, but I was not expecting it. <laughs> Uh, I'll just fall. Screw it. There is a bonfire. I would like to check out. So if I had to respawn, I'd rather respawn here than anywhere else. <laughs> Alright, but I think we have to walk backwards a little bit. This is gonna suck. Ow. Hey, I feel like a speedrun strat would be to run and actually jump onto that bridge somehow. I am not that good. Okay. Let's see, there's a couple of them here. Definitely doing more damage than before. That one's not there. Kind of weird. Just 
just thinking I might be able to get through this pretty quickly. Alright, which way are you going? Okay. There is one down there I can't get to. So I don't think I have a key. I don't have a key. All right, we'll go back though. This will be the quickest way back. I wonder if I can sneak up on you. Well, bad news with... Anyway. Let's say bad news with them is I still need to kill them in about three hits. The good news is I can at least get four strikes on it. I think one of the electric lizard people are here. Yeah, like right there. I might as well fight you. Yeah, hello. I just love I can do four hits now. <laughs> that feels so nice. Actually, now that I think about it. Ow. Let's grab out you. How many... There's a door I can open. Oh no. <laughs> we will live. There's a door I can open. I forget how many... I think I need 20,000 soul for it. Can I grind that real quick? while I'm here, because I feel like I'm never going to go back if I don't do it now. I should have done it when I was back in the Andor on uh, um, Andor Lando. With the blacksmith down here... Thank you. <laughs> the blacksmith down here has... Is my weapon done? He's just never gonna finish it. Um, what am I thinking of? Repair. Repair, yes. Is this a Norlando? The place I just left was a Norlando. That really shiny place. Also, high draft. Quack to you too. How you doing? The place I just left that had those giant soldiers that were giving me like fifteen hundred soul. That I couldn't get by that big bright light. That's an Orlando. If I said that correctly. Which I will continue to say. I just made it there. Uh, I could not go forward because there was a big bright light and I can go through it um, to give you an idea um, so I'm not sure if many people know this I stole this from bears and beats <laughs> she's the best thank you for this um, she made a bosses command I thought it was genius just to get an idea of what bosses we found but to let you know the bosses I found that's, that's everything we've encountered so far uh, and we haven't encountered anything else so what I've pretty much been doing is anything I've beaten I made a list on, and then if I've encountered anything, I throw it in progress to let you know, like, hey, I know of this boss, but... <laughs> Those are the bosses we've beaten, and we haven't encountered anything else, so... In that order. Uh, we just beat the Iron Golem at the beginning of the stream. Kind of accidentally, but we beat it. <laughs> Can 
Can I upgrade? No, I want the Twinkling Tiny. <laughs> so badly. There's one, I want to upgrade the sword. It's the only sword I want to upgrade. I don't want anything else. Oh, no. Actually, that's what I wanted to do. Um, this. 20,000. Okay. I don't have enough. Um, the only thing I can think of doing is going through Sen's Fortress a couple times. And I would have enough eventually. Maybe after like two attempts. <laughs> I'm kind of curious what the crest open. I know what, where it is. I've been by it. I want to open that up. But I figured since I'm already here, I might as well grind a bit. So I have souls. Like how many? Not much. <laughs> Just talking to myself. Uh, I have these three. No, I'm gonna use them now. Just get an idea how many souls I have. That's only 1200. This isn't gonna be much more. It's probably only gonna be like 400, I think. If that. Uh, 200. So I still need like another. Uh, approximately a little over 13,000. But the enemies get here give you 500 per, so it's not that bad. Like a run or two through Sun's Fortress, I would have enough. And even if I get killed, I kind of feel confident enough. Oh my god, there's heals now. Um, I feel confident enough I can make it back through it in one go, if I really have to. I want to open that door. It's a goal of mine now. Like I want, I want to do it. But how are you doing, Trav? How's your How's your week going? How's your day going? So there's definitely a couple of them I have to kill. Uh, kill you. Beautiful. So we're already just about halfway there. Wow. More of them? Yeah, there's two. That's a thousand. <laughs> I just want to take him out real quick. Right, come on up. Fred. There we go. I think like, I need like 20 more of those. It's not gonna take long. I think one more run through here I'm gonna have to do. But seriously, it's not even that bad. Oh crap. <laughs> That's bad. <laughs> oh. Forgot about that. I really should be doing this on Norland though. <laughs> hey, I'll go back there real quick and just get enough souls so I can just move on.
That honestly might be the best strategy for me. Actually, I might as well go back to the bonfire that's there. Like, am I, I think my flask goes up to 10 when I use that one. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try not to die here. We'll go back to Norla. If I'm saying it incorrectly, please let me know as well. So I don't butcher your ears. I think I'm going to head back there. If I don't really have a good amount of souls. Grind like a teeny little bit and then head back. Just so I have enough to uh, get that sealed open. Doing pretty good. Playing some Elden Ring New Game Plus. Hell yeah. Seriously, everyone's on that freaking Elden Ring grind. I'm so proud of everyone. <laughs> Oh no. Okay, we're good. Was finding a giant guard girl so I couldn't respond? No, you're good. <laughs> hey, don't let me interrupt you. Do what you gotta do. Alright. Some things are more important than conversations. And in the battle to the death against an enemy in Elden Ring? Or any Souls like game? I can wait. <laughs> I know the importance. You get you gotta do what you gotta do, right? A Goyle's gotta do what a Goyle's gotta do. I just want to say thank you so much for calling Rugrats just now. <laughs> I actually watched it yesterday. <laughs> if only these games had a pause button. A Goyle's gotta go what a Goyle Goyle's do. <laughs> My uh, brother apparently DVR'd an episode of the new Rugrats. So I guess they put the 3D one on Nickelodeon? So I thought it was only Paramount Plus, but apparently I guess they started airing them on Nickelodeon now. So my brother DVR'd an episode. <laughs> he showed me. At... Oh no. I, I kicked the souls. <laughs> I don't know what's in that. It's probably something horrible, but... I gotta go back. I'll heal. Very happy I went back. <laughs> 3D Rugrats? Yeah. So here's the deal. The voice actors and everything for the babies are just like the original. So that's the good thing about the show. The bad thing is everything else, in my opinion. <laughs> just because, like, you know, growing up, we watched the original, the 90s one, the cartoon one. 3D felt weird, but the characters and the dynamic and everything felt the same, which was nice. It was just weird seeing them in 3D. They had an episode where uh, the babies were uh, trying to find their superhero gimmick, and uh, I us to say Susie, Angelica had a. Which is, the, which is the part that threw me off. Angelica has a smartphone. Which I would 100% believe Angelica would have a smartphone. At her age. But she has a smartphone. I'm like, okay, what year is this again? <laughs> Smartphones didn't exist back then. But she has a smartphone and she was trying to tell all the babies that they look... They won't grow up to be people. They'll grow up to be something else. So they had like those filters, like Snapchat filters. Where you look like different uh, characters or creatures. So like Tommy was a dog. 
Uh, Ch Chucky was a ghost. I think Phil was... Phil was like an alien. And Lil... What was Lil? Oh, you Lil was like a unicorn. But the problem was Susie, which she ended up being a taco. <laughs> and she wasn't very happy being a taco. So the rest of the episode is her just trying to find her superhero powers of being a taco. <laughs> she eventually found it. That was Taco Tuesday and stuff. She threw some uh, <laughs> tortilla chips. I mean, I was all fine and dandy. Is Dr. Lipshit shit still a thing? Lipshits? Wait, I'm trying to remember who that is. I don't even remember Lip... Wait, am I saying the name right too? Dr. Lipsh... Lipshites. I don't remember this character. I am saying it right. Okay, lip sh lip shits. <laughs> I was trying to make sure. I'm like, you know what? This says something, something like in like the 80s, 90s that they would use a name like this. But let me like double check. Like, am I saying that right? Ah, crap. Well, at least I saved. <laughs> if something goes wrong, I will be ready. Oh no, I rolled the wrong way. I rolled the wrong way. Alright, y'all can stay back. Oh my god. That heal's beautiful. Come at me, bro. Alright, you can come at me less. I just need to get a hit. I knew that was happening. I failed. Oh no. Get up, get up, get up. Roll! <laughs> I didn't roll. <laughs> Alright, so good news is I'm right there. So I can just grab that and move on. Not too worried about that. Okay, good. Perfect. So reinforcing it does keep it at plus two flask. That's what I was most concerned about. The baby professional who Didi was obsessed with. I forgot about that. I don't remember the actual character, but that does sound very familiar. Ow. Get up, get up. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> you did unlock a memory. I didn't remember that character from Margaret's. There's a chest back there. I need, I need it. <laughs> Ow. Oh, come on. That range is not, should not be legal. All right, you're next. I almost have enough. Cameron. I need to get like two or three more. I feel like I'm not even doing any damage to them the way it sounds. One of these chests are not like the other. I fucking knew it. <laughs> so am I dead? I'm actually alive. It's a miracle. Can I kill the chest out of curiosity? Yeah, you know what? Screw your chest. Oh my god, that's terrifying. I've never seen a mimic with legs. Kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it, kill it! I have enough. Hello? 
I have encountered a mimic. I haven't actually fought one. Which now I want to go back to send the Sen's Fortress where I encountered the other mimic and kill that one too. So the last mimic I encountered was at that uh, was at the fortress, and it killed me <laughs> very quickly. Just it grabbed me and eat me. But I guess I got my endurance up enough where I can actually survive from mimics now. I'm like this one should be normal. Twinkle, yes. Sorry, I'm happy. <laughs> I want that. I want that badly. I want that for my sword. All right, cool. That's that's. That's awesome. It's had a twinkle in my soul. But yeah, no, that was the first uh, mimic I've actually encountered. <laughs> Ain't that the <a> move? <laughs> ever have to? Yeah, I guess I. I think of it that way. It's like ever have to apologize for just being happy. <laughs> yeah. You're not allowed to be happy in this game. Alright, pray like the Undertaker and then let's go. Make sure I don't accidentally spend my souls. I need those. Oh, so yeah, like I mentioned, this is an Orlando. Uh if you did not know. Now I've said it again. <laughs> Honestly, this place is like gorgeous. Actually, maybe this is more like Breath of the Wild Hyrule Castle? <laughs> yes. <laughs> It just feels familiar to me. I don't know why. Now I'm thinking Hyrule Castle from Breath of the Wild, though. I was saying uh, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> thinking like Castle Oblivion. Now I'm thinking more like Hyrule Castle. It's just, it's just a very nice castle. That's all. All right. So I have two goals now. I want to go back. Uh, I need to purchase... I can skip through this, right? Yeah. <laughs> I want to purchase a seal. Um, and can I fall? Uh, I can, but no. <laughs> One of those things was like, yes, but no. Okay. Uh, I want to go back and buy the seal to open that door in the dark forest. So I just, I'm just, I just want to know where it leads me to. If anything. And then once I get back. Um, maybe I'll make a quick run through here. Just get to that mimic and kill it. But I do want to know. What's the difference with the halberds? <laughs> so I've had the gargoyle one. Like how good is this crystal halberd I just got? Holy, this might be better than my, oh wait, it's so, why are you like that? There's like no durability of this weapon. It's so good. <laughs> Is there like any like information about it? Long hilted weapon mixing spear and ax. It's difficult to handle, requiring both strength and dexterity. The halberd has two elemental elementary attacks, spear-like thrusting and a large sweeping swings. However, one false swing and the wielder is left wide open. All right, so it's normal. Um, I do have enough strength and dexterity. Actually, no. Do I have enough? No, I do have enough dexterity, but... Okay. Hmm. This place gives me flashbacks. 
I mean, it is a crystal. It is. I was just hoping maybe I could reinforce it. If that's possible. Because I would really like to. Oh, so shower time, BRB? Okay. Have a good shower. GG on the workout. Enjoying the cleansing. So can I jump across to that? Can I make that jump? I feel like I can. I can. Okay, what's over here? Hello? You're a human. Ah, what? What is it? Who are you? Ah, another undead, eh? I took on Saint Fortress alone, but I know it's no different from those vile creatures. I was driven by conceit. Ah, you think you're different? That you can handle it? Yes, I honor with that feeling. For I was the same. So, let me help you out with your soul. Okay. He has shards. Which I would like to buy. <laughs> Boulder shield. Okay. It's <laughs> I can get the calorie and the helms and stuff from him. It costs a lot though. Thunder stone plate ring and spell stone plate ring. Boost magic defense and boost light defense. Okay. I was kind of hoping you have something else. Temporary boost of stamina recovery speed. I mean, it has good items. Plus five reinforcement magic divine fire weapon. <laughs> We're gonna die. <laughs> Why are you talking to me? Good day. Nothing at all. Fine then. I've seen like a naked babe be skinned alive. Hey, right, well, good talk. At least I know if I need shards, I can always go back to this guy. But what? What's down here? It's like a shortcut, that would be nice. Oh, hi. Oh, it's you! I know where this is. Cage key. Oh, I needed this. Okay, cool, 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 cool. That's the ball. Okay. <laughs> Every single time I'm thinking, I'm like, okay, I have a plan on what I want to do. I get detoured and there's like a million other things now I want to do. Now I have another thing I need to do. <laughs> so I can go turn that ball around, break the wall, go back inside. Free that guy from the cage. If I can somehow make it across here. I mean, maybe I can fall and live. <laughs> I don't think I can. But you know. <laughs> I don't think I can. <laughs> Unless I fall like there. I oh, thank you. Appreciate it. But if I fall like here. Oh, those are spikes. Yeah, I don't want to fall there. Um, I'm trying to figure out a way that... <sighs> Alright. Okay. I wasn't sure if I was gonna make that jump. <laughs> thank you, for, thank you for the golf claps. Appreciate it. All 
Alright, let's use the spawn fire. Kind of feeling bad because I want to use my souls right now. <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to. I need to be another level up. <laughs> Ow. Oh, I forgot about that. Hopefully I spawn right there. <laughs> Please tell me I spawn there. Thank you. <laughs> that would have been heartbreaking if I did not. Alright, I'll hold off on using my humanity. For now. terrifying thing I could think of going back through I'm like if we can just get through that the rest of the way is kind of smooth sailing and there's normally well normally I'm going back for some reason there's not one there it's kind of weird This is where I want to be. I need to turn you the other direction. This way. So this should open the door down there. Also, hello. <laughs> the snake probably woke up like a big boulder right in your face. Yes. All right, so I think I can open these gates now. These cages. Let's see if I can do this. Yep. Awesome. There were things. Oh, hello. Don't mind me. Go on ahead. I'll be along later. Whoa, I'll be just fine, young one. Okay, cool. Uh, you. What's in here? Can I grab this? Okay. Soul of a hero. Gotta save my souls. <laughs> Sounds like a lot. Just gonna wait to spend it. I want to take that mimic on. That's further up in here. Yeah, let's do it. I I will get back to where we need to be. I want to take the mimic on. So I can do less travel. Less traveling to deal with in a bit. I'm just gonna go and gamble with everything. I 
I do realize where that's coming from now, because there's the other giant. That's uh down there. Alright. There we go. So you should drop something nice too, right? Yep. Lightning spear? Uh, where's that spear at? <laughs> I want to see it. There we go. That's yeah, good durability. Uh, standard spear used commonly by soldiers. Long range can be used with shield up. Effective against hard exteriors and can hit for high damage at the right moment of an enemy swing. But the hit radius is small and is easily blocked by shields. But it's lightning. <laughs> they missed the big part there. It's lightning. Ooh. Cool. All right. <laughs> Just one to look at. It. Am I good rolling wise? I am. Should probably take this way back. We'll, we'll get back to our regularly scheduled uh, programming. I want to know how much the souls of the hero are. I probably should look it up before using it. I feel like it's gonna be like a lot, like a lot, a lot. Thought about trying to spear, I'm like, eh, do I want to risk this right now? Three, three. How many swings can I get out of this? Four. I might have to try it out. Probably, I should have not done that. Well, that happened. <laughs> I was like, why is there, why are those lizard guys here? <laughs> Never here. There should be the two here. Mike, I'm not risking it. There we go. All right, I collected a good amount of soul. All right, so let's buy that seal. There's a couple things I can buy from shopkeepers though. Because there's, there's a seal. Um, there was another key. I don't remember who it was, but I remember someone had another key I could buy. I don't remember where it brings it to. But I want to spend the twenty thousand. I want to get this. That's like number one. Well, hello again. You seem to be doing all right. Need any? Crest, op crest open, sealed door in the heart of the forest. All right. Accomplished. Get neither. All right. Let me check real quick. Solve. What is this called again? Soul of a hero. Alright, 
this will give me 10,000. I figured it'd be a lot. <laughs> Didn't think it would be that high. That's high. I might actually be able to level up if I wanted to. That's the thing. It's like if I wanted to level up, I might just off. Um, I'm just trying to think if it's worth it. So I want to go back through the dark forest and open that door now. I'm just trying to decide if I want to... I mean, I guess I have to wait here regardless. Sorry they run by the big statue guy down there. Hi, friend. <laughs> Say you're not my friend guy. It's gonna run. It's just gonna run. So I'll take a stick into my old uh, habits, but we're gonna run. Behind me? Now we're good. I've come a long way. <laughs> if I can get hit once by those things, I'm not taking much damage now. I've come a long way. <laughs> These things used to take me out in like two or three hits. I used to think 100 soul is a lot. I want to go up there. One hit now. I feel so accomplished. I want to grab the thing that's over there, but I guess I'll go back. At some point. Yeah, I think the seal opens this, if I got it correct. So I want to see what this will do. Is this like breakable? Wait a minute. Are you kidding me? Do you know how much back <laughs> traveling I had to do? <laughs> Come on. This entire time there was a bonfire here? I would have made the butterfly travel so much better if I knew that. I guess I can open this. It's right there, so why not? Use crest of Artorias. Artori Wait, have we been here? There's a gentleman. Wait, they're attacking. Wait, where the hell am I? Oh my God. Wait. Why are humans attacking me? Also, I want my souls back. <laughs> also, also, I don't think I should be here. Maybe late. I uh, let me try one more time. 
Also, if I can, like, somehow... Lure one out. Not worry about the other. I don't even know why you're rolling like that. This is even harder than the other place. Wait, but why are humans here, though? Seriously. I, I make a really level up quicker if I needed to. There's a couple humans. Jesus. I feel like I literally want to grab these two and just move on. <laughs> Another one there. I could use my, uh, I guess my hero thing on level up real quick. I don't think I should be here. Is my problem. I might come back later. I want to explore here. I'm going to wait. Even though if I do need to grind some at some point, forget it Orlando. <laughs> We're going here. I think Lando is a little bit more of a travel. <laughs> this is like perfect. All right. Uh, yeah, let me use this hero. I will try to remember where the other thing is I need to buy. I don't remember. I'll get my endurance up again. I think I want to keep my endurance like two or three higher than my strength. I just like my endurance. Let's take these trees out. We'll head back. If I can. Hello. Can I? This is what I really want to know. Like, can I get over there somehow? Wait, you can go down there? I actually thought that was death. That's death. I didn't know you can actually explore down there. Oh, there's another tree hero. Let me take this tree out. <laughs> let me, let me, no, let me uh, kill this thing before I forget. But so over there looks like exploration. There's the other one that's coming toward me. That's a giant one. Am I going toward that? <laughs> uh, yeah, I think I'm just going to head back. So good to know. I mean, this is an area I can explore in the future. Is there a path up there? Wait. this maybe not actually uh, wait I think I know where this leads to so I think that's where the hydro is at yep oh wait no the hydro is right underneath me no maybe I've been not here are you? 
probably experience I just lost. It's another one. Got a longbow. <laughs> so I keep looking down like it's, it's over there. I love like accidentally finding these things. Just like new areas to be like, oh yeah, you've never been here. There's like another huge K. It's one of you guys. My heal. Play it safe. Actually, I'm gonna lure you up here. I need, I need I need like a battleground. Yeah, let's do this. You're actually not that tough. Thank God. Damn, just high enough level. I feel like I should have been here a while ago. Yeah. Say eighteen thousand. It's not bad. Or eighteen hundred. I mean, that enemy should have been a problem. Grass Crest Shield. Let's see how it is compared to my current one. Eh, it's not that good. It's good, it's just not not better. It's not bonfire. E. Lit. <laughs> um. God, this is the thing of the games. Like every single time, I feel like I'm. I have a plan. On the areas I want to go, this happens. An undo irregularities. Never mind. What is this outfit? Oh my goodness, you're a porcupine. Listen, I have a beautiful spiky shield. It is gorgeous. It is made of crystal. Shines bright like a diamond, uh, but also hollow bears. How are you doing? How are you feeling, by the way? It's good to see you. We are actually making really. I just realized where this went to. Sorry. We're actually making really good progress today. <laughs> I I beat a boss. Accidentally beat a boss. I felt like the boss I was gonna fight was gonna take all stream. It ended up taking fifteen minutes. <laughs> So now I'm kind of going through a lot of areas I didn't expect I would go through. I think this is going to get me into the New Londo Ruins. That's my guess. Maybe not. Can I pull the lever? Oh, I don't know where this is going. It's going somewhere. Dragon? Oh uh, no. Okay. <laughs> Can I give myself a second? I didn't know there was Soul Sonic the Hedgehog crossover. Please. <laughs> you feeling okay? Okay. Accidental boss kill? Dang. Yeah. We've, uh. I stole your command, by the way. <laughs> Recently. So I have a boss's command, given the idea. But, yeah, we. There's, I guess, a tactic I guess I could have used. 
and I accidentally knocked off the bridge. <laughs> yeah, I fell off the bridge and I didn't have to fight it. It just died, which felt nice. But yeah, I felt like there's a lot of this in this game compared to Bloodborne. Bloodborne felt like you have to fight them. This one, I felt like there's easy ways to beat some bosses if you can figure it out. Which I felt like I've been figuring it out a lot easier. 15 minutes, Souls boss kill. <laughs> sure, it's totally been there. But yeah. Oh, fuck. I don't know how tough you are. Oh, you're tough. That's not good. To give you a rough idea, I've been taking enemies out in probably a couple hits. With this weapon. Um, it's not good if it's taking me five or six hits to kill one enemy. I don't think I should be here. <laughs> you know, I might go back. I, I just need to know. I no, I don't. I well, there's a save. Actually, that's not that bad. That's bad. That's actually very bad. You know what? Hey, number. You know, uh, maybe I'll kill this one just to see how much if I can can kill this one. I can't kill this one. Good news is there's a bonfire. <laughs> so I can go back to these souls pretty quickly. I was just kind of curious how many souls I would get out of this dragon. How you doing, number? Welcome on in. Hope it works everything going well for you. Uh, the I am not going back here. I thought this was going to lead somewhere else, and it led to somewhere far, far worse. Close to it, but far worse. Let me go get my souls back. And I'm done here. <laughs> I want nothing to do with these dragons right now. Bye bye. We'll come back. Come back down the road. Yeah, we ended up getting into an area that I actually could not progress. I'll keep a spoiler free, but I couldn't progress any further. So now I'm kind of getting to the point of where I'm backtracking the old areas where I was just dying a lot. And sort of just re-exploring them to see how well I do now. So I was in plenty of areas where I just died so quickly. <laughs> just because I just wasn't strong enough and I wasn't well equipped. But now I'm kind of getting to that point where I want to go back to those areas. So I feel like I can handle them better. And there's like one or two specific areas I really want to go to. I feel like I can handle it now. I don't know how well I can handle it, but I feel like I can handle it well enough. So There's a lot of backtracking. It's the only other thing. <laughs> it's a lot of traveling and a lot of backtracking. But it's not that bad, though. Oh, hey. Oh, damn. Does it have a lot more branches of possible places to go than Bloodborne? Honestly, I think so. I think Bloodborne is a bit more... I would honestly say Bloodborne might be a little bit more linear. It's very similar. I will say Bloodborne's fighting definitely feels better. Cause it's definitely a newer game, like mechanic wise. Like I can't really dodge as well in this game as you could with Blood, uh, Bloodborne. Fighting styles are very similar. Like I can, I think there's an enemy here. Yeah, so I can like lock onto this enemy and still fight him. But I don't like back step or anything like that. Like this part fighting style feels the same. 
Like this feels like Bloodborne. But I think it feels better with Bloodborne. Burrs. I have gotten to points where I've just ran by enemies. Because <laughs> I'm just like, I'm not strong enough to fight you. I'm just going to run by you. Like, there's one enemy in here, I think. I've probably for the last like, 20, 30 levels or so. I'm like 55 now. I think I've recently fought, found this enemy when I was like level... I want to say I was in my 20, like 20 something. I couldn't fight it. I'm like level 55 now. I'm like, I still can't fight you. But I just run from them whenever I see them. Can you hit me from here? No. Oops. I think the only other thing that's a little different is that Bloodborne has more of like a HUD or like that little like safe area where you can travel back and do everything like getting your equipment and stuff upgraded um, in this game you don't have that which is somewhat of a negative because you actually have to literally travel through all the old areas to, uh, that's awesome. Sorry. I'm just happy to get the sword upgrade. Um, you do have to like backtrack to certain areas to get like certain upgrades or find certain shopkeepers. They're not all in like one spot. I think that's one negative I would say. Otherwise, it's not a huge difference. Don't get yourself killed. Neither of us want to see you go hollow. I'm already hollow. Um, level 55 plus, you got that really cool spiky shield. That's true. Yeah, I think the other thing with this as well is that there's a lot of equipment balancing. I don't think Bloodborne had that. But your equipment has weight in these games. So if like I if I have too much armor on. Uh, where are you at? Yeah, so like it has equipment load. So like the weight I have with my weapons and everything is like 43.9 out of 105. But if I think if it's like 60, uh, if I get to like 60, 70 ish, like I can level up my equipment load. But if my equipment loads too low, or if I have too much equipment and it's too heavy, I roll a lot slower. So I move a lot slower. Personally, to me, I, ha I did not like it. So I had to try to find a balance between like the armor that I have and trying to find like a playable style. Yeah, pretty much. But the more you level up, the heavier the weapons you can actually put on. Also, we're in like a beginning area, so these enemies are just whatever. Gotcha, I think I'd seen something about that. I'd definitely be frustrating. Actually, thing to balance. It's a little frustrating. You get used to it after a while, and then you get to a point where you hit a level and like it doesn't really affect you that much. But yeah, is that a staircase? Um, but yeah, I've, <laughs> I've been running into things like that. Now I'm all the way back in the beginning area. Because I need to uh, gesture. All right. Well, first we're going to save. Oh, fire keepers absent.
What's the thing? <laughs> it's the only other thing I saw that I realized I missed. I didn't realize there was a staircase here. <laughs> Never been down here. Dingy hood, dingy robe, dingy gloves, bloodstained skirt. Black eye orb. Dead. <laughs> okay. Wait, is there someone supposed to be in there? Whoops. Maybe whoops? Never mind. Where is this lead to? I feel like today's been like a bunch of finding areas that I've never kind of explored and learned there's a bunch of shortcuts. Oh my god, this is Londar Ruins. first <laughs> I'm finding all these areas I've could have explored such a long time ago like now infuriating <laughs> maybe infuriating I don't know I don't know how I would have done back then. I think there was supposed to be someone actually in that cell. But they're dead. I wonder if maybe that was the person I was keeping this up. snake thing no actually yes I want to feed you stuff I am pleased to see you well is it something urgent because apparently this is a shopkeeper and I can feed it items to give me some soul. I just want to give it my duplicate items. That's all I want to do. Uh, that's a duplicate. So the good news is you can carry as many items as you want. The weight and everything just varies based on... The uh, I am to be equipped rather than really anything else. check this area out. I have not done this area since our second day of streaming. I just want to see how well I do now. Give you an idea, those enemies took me forever to kill before. I can kill them in one hit. I could not do that before. <laughs> Took me maybe 
five or six minutes. <laughs> it actually feels very satisfying. Like butter. E. No, that's like, <laughs> it's extremely satisfying. I think I can take this area on though. I've spent hours in this area. So it's weird. That's actually so easy now. <laughs> it's very anticlimactic. <laughs> Even the big one. Holy crap. Yeah, seriously. It's kind of weird how easy this is. I don't even want to fight those. I think I can definitely do this area now. I don't know how well. I think I'm definitely better equipped than I was back then. Uh, yeah, you. Oops. I think there's one underneath me. No, there's two here. Yeah. I should have went back here a long time ago. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to use the bonfire. Like, seriously, you have no idea how long it took me just to get down here last time. <laughs> it took hours. It just took me like five minutes this time. Like, this one specific area up here probably was an entire stream. And then I eventually just gave up. <laughs> I leveled up a lot. That was a good thing. back to where I was. Okay, yeah, now I remember. There is someone I need to kill. <laughs> I can never get the kill. It's like a... Hard to explain. But these skeletons that keep attacking me keep reviving. And I have to kill the source of it. If I recall... I could always get you but never kill. I think it was here. Right, I'm just gonna go. Should be able to do this now. I might heal just in case. Yeah, that was way easier. Perfect. Okay. Should be a third one. Plus it's dead. Alright. <clears throat> Alright. I never went further in this. So that was cool. 
Oh yeah, there's those weird things. And it went into the wall. Somewhere. Alright, that was actually very weird. I glitched. Oh. There's another one? Crap. Alright, well I gotta look for it. So I am looking for... Don't know if y'all stay dead. Oh, hello? <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> okay, I killed you. Great. These skeletons are goofy looking. <laughs> I need to get the hell out of here. Actually, can I just kill them easily? Alright, maybe I can. I've had so many problems with these things before. They would kill me in one head. That's the problem. Um, I'm looking for... One of those wizard looking guys again. I have never been down this far before. Oh, hi. So you won't die. Oh, you will die. Never mind. Um, should I grab that? I feel like there's still more crushing it. <laughs> I feel like it's crushing me. All right, I'm just gonna go. I want to grab that. Can I like fall from up there? Maybe. I think that's the boss. Either there, it's another area. <laughs> I think it's gonna be a boss. Um, is there a bonfire? No, uh, yeah, let me look real quick <laughs> before I go any further. So this game has these walls. I kind of warn you when something, something in front of me. But either if you're getting to like a checkpoint and like a new area or a boss battle is about to happen. And it's one of the two. I'm a little fearful it's a boss. So I'm kind of curious if there's like a bonfire or something like that I could light up. Oh, it's in here. Nothing. Cool. Um, I don't think there's anything. Well, this isn't here. Actually, it could be in here. I just want to quickly explore this spot real quick before I go any further. I think there's a skeleton up here. Or a couple. Three, five. <laughs> so I fell... Yeah, let me fall through here. Oh. Explains you. <laughs> this feels like it's breakable. <laughs> Guess not. Nope, we're back here. Alright, let's just go. 
I mean, who knows? Maybe we'll, it won't be nothing. <laughs> It'll be nothing, maybe. I don't think it's going to be nothing. <laughs> Maybe it is nothing. Uh, I don't know what this is. Can I walk somewhere? I think that's going to hurt. Ah, oh, crap. Design-wise, is actually kind of cool. Pinwheel? There's three of them. It's not strong. Okay, I'm a little overleveled. <laughs> By way of kindling, you may, you know, kindle beyond the normal limit. I'm over leveled. <laughs> First off, I don't even know what that means. Mask of the Father. That was a boss. I think I should have fought this boss a long time ago. I killed it in like three shots. <laughs> I think I should have. Oh my god, I don't even know why I should have fought this boss. Because I went through like this area I had access to on like the second day of my stream. And I spent in this area so long. And I never went anywhere with it because I just kept dying once I got down to that area with those spinning skeletons. So I was just like, forget it. I'll come back later. That was like six streams ago. So now. <laughs> come to this. Um, damn. Damn. I was not expecting that. That was a weird boss. Next question is how do I get out? Also, what's the mask? Also, this kindling thing. Should I have gotten this like hours ago? <laughs> Here we go. Mask of the Father. I don't think it's very good. It's not. <laughs> One of the three masks of the pinwheel, the necromancer who stole the power of the grave lord and reigns over the catacombs. This mask belonging to the valiant father slightly raises equipment load. Oh. It's kind of cool. I feel like this mask would have been very useful a long time ago. <laughs> All right, here's my problem. I'm stuck.
Oh, it's a liar. Good. I think I got a feeling there was a ladder over here before. What's that? Shortcut ahead. Mm. <laughs> I don't trust this game. Oh. Okay. Tomb of the this is new. Is it eyes? Or is that a torch? I think those are eyes. That's <laughs> an enemy. <laughs> what are you? Alright, bring it on. Oh, you're a giant skeleton. Okay. It's actually less terrifying than I thought. Oh. Oh, that's not good. All right, this area sucks. <laughs> so I think I can make it back. I think I can make it back. <laughs> Rip. I'm just like... I should have been down here a long time ago. <laughs> this area does indeed suck. Thank you. I appreciate that trap. I feel vindicated a little bit. My problem is I want to get the souls back. Which... Can I kill these guys then? Still revive? That's weird. Is there another one of those sorcerers somewhere then? I'm just gonna run. <laughs> if I can't kill them, I'm not gonna fight them. So I can at least kill these skeletons. For some reason, I can't kill the other ones that are outside still. Which, whoops. Well, anyway. Which means that there's another one of those witch looking enemies out there somewhere. Might kind of make a run here. That was a mistake. Not the self. Don't run. Can you like stop that? Stop that. All right. Here's my goal. Just get my soul so I can live again. Oh my god. I just need to live. All I need to do. Just live, and grab my souls. Someone's still following me. I also don't know why I have to fall here. Well, good news, I'm out of uh, soul. <laughs> or not soul, flesh, healing. Just 
gotta be a bonfire somewhere. I don't trust that hint at all anymore. <laughs> I'm starting to feel like I need to follow these candle looking things to get anywhere. Okay, let's try to remember where this was at. I think I see my souls. Alright. <laughs> Good news, at least if I die, I got my souls back. Um, I can't see anything, though. Why? Like, why? That's all. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm just going to go. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. We're learning. I hate this area already. But the problem is the area is not tough. The enemies aren't tough. You just can't see anything. So I'm, kind of, I mean, <laughs> I'm trying to think of like, is there something I can equip? Like, give me some like daylight. So I don't trust those torches. Forgot about that counter. There is a shortcut. <laughs> So I have no souls to lose at this point. Nothing to worry about. So. Let's get a little reckless. Let's try to discover some new shortcuts that we could perhaps take. I guess that's a shortcut. Because I can avoid them all together and just run for it. Oh. Learned something today. I don't know. I'm getting to the point where I'm like, I don't even know if I want to do this area right now. You could still technically go back to the New Londo ruins. I 
Oh, there's a couple spots I could still go to. So, no, maybe there's something at the Londo Ruins I could help out. So you can take those ghosts out. Like, I have no problems with them. My problem is these guys. <laughs> Spinning pinwheels. They're just... Yeah, you know what? Maybe I will do that. <laughs> I don't know if I should go down here. Maybe not right now. Actually, on second thought, maybe I should. I don't know. <laughs> that's the thing is, like the enemies, the enemies are not tough. The area is just annoying. It's just a bit of a walk to get there. Which then makes me think, okay, there's probably a, a bonfire hidden somewhere I could possibly use. But then you ask yourself, where? <laughs> where could this be at? Hello. They are actually very rude. I agree with this. I don't know. Here, I've actually never gone to explore this area. Oh, hi. Is there actually anything over here? Kind of curious why this one always reanimates itself. Oh. I was kind of hoping maybe I could fall down. <clears throat> Excuse me. But I don't think I can. <laughs> so you can climb, come on. <laughs> there you go. I don't like the pinwheels at all, though. They're... That's another enemy. Like, they're not tough. They're just annoying. <laughs> so if you miss them a certain way, they can just keep spitting and pretty much kill you really, really quick. But they, like, they hold on to you so well. Alright, there's my souls. Oh. oh, that actually kind of worked. <laughs> hey, you're already dead. Hey, I got, sh <laughs> I got sh shield out of the wheel. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, come on. Come on, times three. <laughs> I see they run by them. I shouldn't have to fight them. I think I just need to avoid them. My problem is I want to fight them. <laughs> There's just so many. And then it's like you finally get down there and then you get into the new area and then you can't see anything and then you die immediately because there's two giant skeletons right there just ready to pummel you. Just ruthless. All right. I need to figure this out. I know there's something in here. By something, I mean there's nothing. To the death trap. Which is another thing. The game lies to you a lot. The developers will actually leave you hints. 
when in reality it's death. They'd be like, oh, this is treasure. You know, there would be something great in here. You break the wall and it's literally just an empty pit with like two skeletons waiting in there, just waiting to kill you. <laughs> the developers are evil. That's <laughs> what I've come to learn in this Dark Souls game. <laughs> That's why when I went down to that one area, one of the messages said shortcut. I'm not even gonna try it. Cause likely enough, it's probably a shortcut, but it's gonna lead you to some, probably gonna lead you to your death. That's my guess. Yeah, prize. I think it might be. Honestly, that's like the perfect emo for that situation. I feel like literally it's just a prize, but in reality, when you open it up, it's like just death. Here's dead. I'm not even bothering. I'm just gonna go. And pray there's nothing behind me. There's there's a lot behind me. <laughs> there's a lot behind me. Hello. Goodbye. Ow. Okay, okay, okay. There's like three of them. Ow. Okay. I'm just going. I gotta stop. <laughs> There's gotta be an easier way to go down here. Okay. Um, ladder. So my thing is I want them I just want a bonfire to be here. That's all I want. If I can get a bonfire here, at least I don't have to travel all the way through the catacombs again. Like what's he? actually yeah, a good point? What's over here? Be nice if there is actually something here. I don't think there's gonna be, but no. <laughs> I don't even know I'm supposed to be over here. It's glitching the game. I figured the developers would give you something for like finding an area that you're not supposed to be in. Nope. Just pain. Actually, wait. I can't cheat this. <laughs> Gives me temporary light. <laughs> Don't know why. All right. All right. You know what? I will check this out. It's probably gonna be a horrible thing to do, but we'll do it. Shortcut. I don't believe you. Let's see. Nope. <laughs> Not even gonna try. <laughs> Just can't do it. What is that though? Alright. So the thing I do know is that at least I gotta follow the lights. It's at this point just trying to remember where everything is. And hopefully if I can get past this part and get to wherever that lava area is, maybe that'll be easier. Like that's a trap. <laughs> Go forward, there's nothing there. <laughs> All right, trying to remember. Is there a skeleton guy here? No. Skeleton guy's down here. 
Not this one, but like the next one. Or no, it is this one. Yeah, there's like one right there. Large soul of a proud knight. Nice. Alright, so we got some soul. Just trying to remember where I'm at. Alright, there's two like right here. Yep, there's the other one. Fuck! <laughs> Getting close. Maybe. I don't know. <laughs> Alright. I'm actually going to take a really quick BRB. I need to take a little out. It's 10 o'clock. Um, feel free to stretch, get water, whatever you need to do. I think I need to de-stress for a minute or 10. <laughs> but feel free to do what you got to do. Um, if you don't know, we do have a YouTube video up. If you ever want to check it out. Um, I put like a little compilation together of our PF Green Nuzlocke. Um, I think he did really well with it. Very proud of it. Is this the Kindle thing they're talking about? I've never used that. I have no idea what it is. Anyway, um, but if you want to check it out, feel free. It's just your exclamation mark YouTube. Um, yeah, that's all I got. I'm going to go take my dog. <laughs> have a good break. Stay cozy. Don't stress out. Relax. All right, I'll be back. <laughs> Welcome back. Hope oh, everyone had a good break. Lola is eating. I'm probably gonna sleep in this stuff. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Too kind. Too kind. Thank you. Stop it. Alright. Bear is hello. Welcome back to yourself. Oh, we're on a good break. Bears, by the way, I saw your food that you made. Quack a dude. <laughs> All the quacks. The rice with the bean was it the rice and the beans and is it a salad? Looked good. <laughs> I was not hungry, but now I am hungry again. That looks so good. <clears throat> I'm okay, though. No, seriously, it looked really, really good. I'm trying to remember what I was just doing. All oh, right, down here. Pretty simple to make, and then I have a recipe. Even better. And honestly, some of the simple stuff are the best stuff you can make. That is an area I definitely need to start dwelling into a little bit more. My my family and I we have too much fast food. I think probably. Like three days of the week we have fast food. So I'm trying to have less of it. Also, I think I have someone at my door. I thought I had Lola at my door. I was like, what's she doing? <laughs> Definitely same. Yeah. Wait, can I climb this? Not climb this. Pick this up. Why can't I pick this up? <laughs> this should not be happening. <laughs> Like a little bowl. Oh, there she is. Hold up. Hello. Oh. 
Oh, one sec. I can't pause. <laughs> What's up? Oh, okay. What was that? What was that? Okay. What was that? Tell you a good girl. She's doing good. She's a uh, well here but yeah she's good she had uh she's been sleeping <laughs> yeah no it's new there says hi what was i hey she loves you <laughs> she's like i don't know who you are she does not like cameras <laughs> That was a big yawn. Yawn? Yeah. Good. Good. Want to take over? What do you want to tell the world? Tell the people what you're thinking. It's your opportunity. She just wants down and wants to explore. <laughs> she does not want to be up here. All right, you good? Breath, All right. Put you down, let you bro, okay? You say bye. <laughs> She's tired. <laughs> yeah. She's like, I'm tired. <laughs> Let me go back to my humans. There's your Lola minute. <laughs> God, her breath stinks right now, though. <laughs> she just had a treat. It did not help. However, but damn. <laughs> Um, I missed a bunch. Cat doesn't really cook, so when I'm not feeling up to it, we just have to order something. But God, a home-cooked meal is so refreshing. It really is. I think she's still in my doorway. Nope, she went to her bed. <laughs> Thank you for blessing us with this Lola minute. <laughs> Surprised she came in. She usually gets a little bit more on the exploration side after I take her out because she's like, okay, I'm up. I want to see what my humans are doing. And then she immediately goes back to bed afterwards. <laughs> now I got an arrow on my shoulder. It's very nice. She's doing good. She's back at my door. Oh, you're ready to guard. Crap. Actually, this could be a good method to grind against him. I, yeah, okay, I can't move. <laughs> Not grind, but at least like take him out one by one. If I ever needed to. I'm just gonna run for it. Hello? Hello? Excuse me. Pardon me. Hello? I'm just gonna go. I'm just gonna like zigzag a little bit because I don't know if they're gonna shoot straight line toward me. But I think we're actually good. For once. <laughs> Alright, I want to heal, but I'm going to hold off. So I think... 
I can take like one hit. I don't have any flask right now. I can't climb. So I'm hitting the wrong button. Alright. I don't have any flasks, so I think I'm gonna hold off on using it. I do you see a glow? Pinwheel boys, you have spike we you have spikes, we have spikes. Let's combine spikes. Just spike it all up. <laughs> just just spikes. Hello, big guy. Goodbye, big guy. Uh, okay, I was trying to remember which way is this. <laughs> Good news is I see my souls. I'm gonna heal just in case. It's more like right there. I don't know where I am. Ow. Ow. Um. <laughs> oh god. Um. Uh. I'm gonna go down here. That's a big skeleton. Okay. Oh, it's a ladder. Oh no! No 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 no! I can live. There's like three of them. I cannot live this. <laughs> Fuck this area. <laughs> That was a large skelly boy, seriously. <laughs> like, they're not even hard to take out. There's just... I can't see. I don't even think it's worth going back right now. I'm not going to night yet. I think I need something. It's way too dark down there. I feel like I need to go somewhere else. Like this is manageable. Like I can see down here. I cannot see anything in that area. I'll leave my souls down there, it's fine. I'm not worried about like 8,000 souls. Got me three streams ago, I'd be crying out of these 8,000 souls, but now I'm like, it's 8,000, whatever. I don't know. I'm not dealing with that again. There's still one other area that I can explore. I want to explore that area first. And if there's nothing there, I'll come back. But I don't want to be anywhere near that area right now. There's gotta be like I gotta have like is there an item? Fade another world? <laughs> Vanish Phantom Return Home. I was trying to think if there's like a lantern or something. Right, which boosts bonfire even further. Okay. The answer is no. <laughs> there is nothing. <laughs> nothing that I have right now. I feel like I, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Who knows? People know. I don't. I just don't think I should be exploring down there right now. It just doesn't feel like an area I should be exploring. <laughs> The 
there was a staircase here. Is this building like the back of it? Oh god. Wait, this thing's gonna end up killing me. <laughs> I do remember seeing a staircase when I was going up the elevator. Or down the elevator. Goes here. Is it here? I mean, that looks like a thing. Actually, it does look like a thing. Wait, is that a path? All right, I want to go that way. Maybe not here specifically. <laughs> or maybe he is here specifically. I don't know. Oh, wait, they're gone? Wait, hold up. Separated from my lady, I've scoured near and far, but no sight of her. Where could she have gone, my lady? To think I swore to protect you with my life. Why did she disappear? There was like a lady there like a couple nights before. She wasn't there before, and then randomly arrived, and now she's gone again. Can I jump in your head? I don't am I gonna try. Um there was a chest I picked up. I wonder if maybe there's more to it. Just don't remember the spot. I actually did pretty well walking. <laughs> All right. Uh, what wasn't there? I'm so curious about this ladder. I do want to go to the new ladder ruins. I just want to check this real quick. If I can remember how to navigate this area. I think it's further up. It just gives me an item and there's nothing else. Oh, it's there. <laughs> Shield's in the way. <laughs> Is there something there? Definitely accessible. How can they get up there? I think I can get up there. It looks like I can get up there.
I may end up getting myself killed before I get up there. <laughs> but if I can, I feel like I can. It just feels like there's like a bunch of small little paths throughout this entire place. If I can just find like the right way. I platform it. <laughs> Perhaps I just wanted the large skull to give you a lift. Either that or Axel Raven that's up there. Or Crow, whatever that is. I'm gonna have to ask the skeleton, 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 skeleton. Uh, access bird, give me a lift. <laughs> Can I? No. All right. I feel like I'm just gonna keep walking through the same like three or so areas until I find something. <laughs> Like when I was over here, I kind of had something going. Just fell. Like that looks like a staircase. That's a nest. Wait. Ah, oh, that would make sense. It's the raven's nest. I have an idea. Wait. Da okay. Wait, 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 wait. It just hit me. <laughs> I think when you just said give skeletons a lift, that just kind of gave me an idea. Okay. The lift. There's a part where it looks like I can jump off. Here. Uh, oh. Yeah, I can go through this area. Wait, hold up. I don't think I should go that way. <laughs> Maybe I can. Hold up. No, I cannot. I can get to that somehow. I might have messed up. Yeah. Can I jump to that? There's a staircase. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want to get to that too. <laughs> I have like other things I want to get to. Oh, oh, that worked. Fuck. <laughs> okay. You can get back up. <laughs> I know where to go. Problem I always run into this game is always input lag. So I'll hit the button twice and it only does it once and then it'll repeat itself sometimes. <laughs> that was one of those times. That was my fault. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna use No I'm not because I can't light the bonfire. Um let's do that again. But this time that suck. I think we can actually climb it. All right, I have to use this one. Can I get over there from here? No, I'm going to try. So I feel like I can run, jump, get on top of this one, roll down. Once I get to there, I don't think I can actually do anything. Maybe I can just get it from there. Maybe I can get across first. 
All right, let me try this again. I was trying the, oops, trying to run. Okay. Yeah, this is a thing. Can I get to you? No. <laughs> Wait, I have to climb back up. <laughs> That's what I know. At least I know I can actually get over here. I'm actually stuck. Wait. Yeah, they gotta do it again. That's fine. I wanna know what's up there. I might get myself killed before I get up there. Fortunately, I only have a thousand soul. This <laughs> fall scare the crap out of you. My bad. Platforming is not the best. It's not very good. But it works. I'm just gonna climb. Oh, I could have just done that. Undead Asylum Floor 2 West Key? I've never been to the Undead Asylum. There's an undead asylum? What's this light? <laughs> oh no. I fell. Wait, hold up. There you go. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> I feel like that's a trap. That's... I've been there. That's directly underneath me. Wait, no. Platforming. <laughs> uh, late stream party. How you doing, Llama? <laughs> Welcome on in. Happy late stream to you. Uh, platforming in Soul Games is terrible. It really is. But I feel like it's also intentional. <laughs> I feel like it's terrible, but also the developers are like, we need it to be terrible. How you doing, Llama? Uh, boots and cats and... That's a lot. Uh, how's your evening? How's your week been going? A jump. I'm amazing. All right. Evening's okay. I was mine. And evening is also fine. I uh, honestly, I took a PTO day for Friday. Actually, I took a PTO day yesterday too, for other reasons. But I took a PTA for Friday, so I have a nice little three-day weekend. So all I have to do is work tomorrow, and then I'm good. Um, but I have some errands and stuff I have to get done tomorrow. Which... Is there anything here? But yeah, no, I'm looking forward to a three-day weekend. It's going to be nice. Slaying the maidens and praising the sun. Uh, yes. So you're very energetic tonight. Curl up like a ball. Okay. I stand up. Oh.
Where am I? I think I've been. Wait, is this the beginning area? This is the beginning area. Why are we. We can go back here? Is there more stuff to do here? <laughs> Fast travel. There must be an achievement where you sit here for as an egg for 24 hours. <laughs> I like the carriage are just like, oh my god. So these are all weak enemies. I know that. Good job, go straight ahead. Oh wait, no, this is for her last time. I think. Yeah, we felt the first boss here. Oh shit. I didn't grab a bonfire. <laughs> <laughs> what? Can't be surprised. <laughs> Just we'll make our way back. Good news is we didn't have much uh, too many souls. Um, that happened. So that boss, <laughs> that boss. What's it called? Stray something? Stray demon? <laughs> Thank you, Trap. That was an experience. I'll tell you that. I wonder... There is a bonfire in that area, so I wonder if I can somehow get to it uh, before falling down to my death into a boss fight. I wonder if this is like a secret boss? <clears throat> but now I want to do it. <laughs> Stray demon. Okay, thank you. It seemed like it was very... It looked very similar to the first one. Which... That was also a demon. And it's a straight. Okay, I get it. That, that, that's that, that's a good one. <laughs> it's a good name. Yeah, <laughs> actually, number. Thank you for that. <laughs> that was a good. That was a good rim shot. <laughs> that made a lot of sense. I mean, it's not a long walk at least, so that's good. As long as you can like do decent platforming. Yeah, this isn't too bad. I think the longest part is just standing there like an egg for like a good 30 seconds before you're just taken away. Like, kind of terrified to actually break the eggs. All right, at least you can just skip the cutscenes. I do appreciate that. Are 
There's gotta be a bonfire somewhere. I don't know if it's here or just anywhere. It's gotta be something. Yeah, I'm not gonna curl up like an egg yet. I think it's like further in. If I recall. It told me to go straight ahead. <laughs> this game. <laughs> Alright, so do not go straight ahead. Walk around the middle area. And they leave a freaking marker there. These developers are evil. <laughs> They're just, they lure you into a trap intentionally. Be like, yeah, you gotta experience this at least once. And they actually hear the growling now too. There's the bonfire. Rest that bonfire, yes, tutorial stuff. Okay, so... Next question is going to be, how do I get down there? Ow. <laughs> Excuse me, I have to go heal now. <laughs> I do want to use the hollowing, though. Not sure if I want to waste my humanity that I have. God, different. Forget it. Are we in here? I just don't know how deep down in here I have to actually go. You were not here before. It's very weird to be back here. There's like an enemy that jumped out, right? Maybe not. All right. Well, you're charging me now. I'm going to run and get into an area where I can move around like a little bit. Ow. Oh my God, you do a lot of damage. Not enough. <laughs> Red Titanite chunk. Okay. I love that there's just bonfires everywhere though. It's beautiful. Alright, maybe I'll just run through here. I don't think I can. Yo, 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 wait, 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 where are you going? Oh, you're fighting me. I thought you were a nice guy. <laughs> no, you're just a soldier. Rude. Crest shield. Yeah, they just added stuff down here. It's actually kind of cool. Like reinventing this area. I do have the key. Is that ball still there? <laughs> oh, because you were dead. And then he came back and fought me. Got it. Got it. That makes more sense now. But I still want to... There's got to be a way to get down to the boss without falling through that hole. It's 
Falling to that hole almost kills me. So I kind of wonder if maybe... Do I have to go all the way back to the very, very beginning? Because it was very far down. So I'm kind of curious if it's down this way. There were a lot of enemies down here. Now that I think about it. That's another one of those nights. Oh, I saw you before. Makes more sense now. All right, so I have to fight one of these enemies again. Cool. Let's see if we can do this. Black Knight Sword. I think I that's the one I have equipped, right? Yeah. Give me another one. This is where I started. Peculiar doll. A strange doll with a strange dress. There once was an abomination who had no place in this world. She clutched this doll tightly and eventually was drawn into a cold and lonely painted world. Why is that a key item? All right, the secret ray allows bonfires to be bolstered further with kindling so that even more S's can be collected. Kindling was a secret ray passed down upon among clerics. But all undead can imitate the process in the same manner that they can restore their hollowing with humanity. A peculiar that humans had found little use for humanity until they turned undead. Okay. Can I break the doors? Okay, so there's gotta be some way down here where I can grab my, oh, no, <laughs> say, oh, no, <laughs> um, where I can fight this guy. I want to fight it. It's gigantic. I don't know if I can take it. I want to try. This is also the last place I figured I'd be today. <laughs> We're gonna be in some other new area or still exploring Sen's fortress. Nope. We're back to Toriel Land. I mean, like, where else? Where else can I go? I don't like it, but there's literally, like, there's nowhere else to, like, where the jump down or anything. We're having some somehow break in and then that go. <laughs> now the game's like, no, we're making sure if you fall, you're going down there and you're fighting it. I want to try to read this. Get away. Well, at least they're honest. Screw it. Come on. Just, just, 
just break. I'll do it again. There we go. First things first, just grab, <laughs> grab that. All right, cool. Oh, jeez. I just need to get into an angle where I can hit it. Can she fire? I don't think I can fight this thing. It shoots the explosives at you? Ah, oh, crap. <laughs> oh, I can at least do damage on it. Alright, that's good. Oh, this thing's gonna be annoying. Problem is the hit radius on it. Please don't fart. Okay. <laughs> All right. I can fight it. Kind of tough, but I can fight it. I really just have to watch out for that hit radius. And that. <laughs> Alright, let's try this again. Do you guys fall with me? Are you for real? <laughs> this game <laughs> all right i think i'll give it a couple more tries <laughs> i'm like why did this one fall with me it got me to a point i just could not grab my souls which to be completely honest i'm not really too worried about the souls i'm just <laughs> if i had like thirty thousand souls and something like that happened to me i would be frustrated it somehow. Alright, let's try this again. Hopefully I don't get distracted. Hello. At least it gives you a second to move. Alright, yeah, move. Honestly, if I can just stay close to it. Step one is that. <laughs> like, it's like close to it. Crap. I did the wrong thing. Alright, we're good. Yeah, that's that's the one thing I need to watch out for. Then there's like long swings. I can just keep letting it do that and nothing else. Come on, one more hit. We're good. Do we get anything for it? Okay, humanity and homeward bone. Titanite slab.
another boss down. <laughs> I think that's three. That's three. Plus 15 reinforcement? Holy crap. This thing is amazing. Alright, let's just quickly... We'll walk around real quick and then we'll probably get out of here. Should probably actually wrap stream. It's a little after 11 already. Okay, yeah, there was no other way to get down here. You had to fall through there and take the damage and then fight it. As far as I can tell. That's like a cool little like hidden boss. It's like definitely not mandatory. It's an optional boss for sure. But that was a fun one. Kinda of simple. Yeah, she maybe was kinda of simple. It was fun. It was fun because I won. <laughs> no. It was fun. Uh let me do endurance again. Then maybe I'll lay off endurance for a while after this. <laughs> All right, did I get some humanity? I'm gonna use it. So do some reverse hollowing. And then I'll check out the Kindle. Oh, I need humanity. The more humanity. Not oh, screw it, we'll try it again. So I need humanity while I am human. Offer humanity and kindle flame. Okay. Oh, and it offers you more flat. That makes more sense now. Okay. I need to start doing that. <laughs> I didn't realize that the, what that, that does. Can I kindle it again? No. Actually, yeah, maybe. Oh, well, it's fine. Um, yeah, I think this is the perfect time to actually wrap stream. So I need to get to bed. <laughs> But I actually feel so freaking accomplished tonight. I feel very, very good after tonight. I did not expect to get this much done. I feel seriously great. Um, thank you for all for being here. I appreciate it. Opens Kindle. It's the power of literature to defeat all enemies. <laughs> Please. Um, thank you all for being here. Appreciate it. Thank you. Yeah, I think we did pretty well tonight. I was only expecting, I was honestly expecting the fate, the face of one of the bosses to hold stream. So finishing off very quickly and then everything else. Um, did not expect that. Like, oh, that was great. And then everything else on top of that it was lovely. Um, but thank you all for being here. I appreciate it. Um, if you want to raid with us, don't know if we have any friends that are on this late to be raiding, but we'll see if there's anyone to raid. But if you want to join along on a raid real quick, uh, we'll drop a really quick raid. 